Hello everyone, welcome to the Linux Int YouTube channel. In this video, we are gonna talk about how we can install and configure Vine on Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. Vine is a free and open source software that allows you to run Microsoft Windows compatible programs and games on Linux, Mac OS and Android. So without any further ado, let's see that how we can install Vine on Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. So in order to install the Vine, first of all we have to download the GPG key of the official Vine package repository with the following command. I am pasting the command here and this command is available in the description of this video. So you can copy and paste it from there. So by using this command we will download the GPG key of the official Vine package repository. So now hit enter. Alright, the key is downloaded successfully. Now we have to add the Vine GPG key to the Ubuntu 20.04 LTS with the following command and the command is sudo apt hyphen key add vinehq dot key hit enter you can see the output on your terminal that is ok it means that the key is added successfully Wine packages are included in Ubuntu repositories by default. However, they are not always up to date. So it is recommended to install Wine packages from the official Ubuntu PPA provided by the Wine team. So to add the Wine repositories on Ubuntu 20.04 LTS, run the following command. So this is the command to add the Wine repository on your Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. Now hit enter. Alright, the Vine repository is added successfully. Now we have to update the apt package repository cache with the following command sudo apt update The apt package repository cache is updated. Now we can install the Vine stable, developer or staging builds by running one of the commands. The official Vine repository provides three different builds that are stable, developer and staging. Stable builds as the name suggests provide the latest stable version of the Vine, while developer builds are in development. Staging builds contain many experimental patches that are intended to test some features or fix compatibility issues. So there is no guarantee that all of these patches will be included in the stable branch in the future. So I am installing the Vine with the stable build. And to install the Vine with the stable build, run the following command sudo apt install vinehq stable. Hit enter. It will approximately take 1.6 GB of additional disk space on your system. So press Y here to continue the installation process. Alright, the Vine is successfully installed on my Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. To check the installed version of Vine on your system and to verify the installation of Vine, run the following command, Vine double hyphen version. And in the output you can see that it is Vine 5.0 that is installed on my Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. You can change many settings and behavior of the Vine. So you can configure the Vine by running the following command. Vine CFG and hit enter. Vine will install some mono packages during the configuration. So in order to install the mono packages on your system, click on the install button. You can select the Windows version during the Vine configuration and here you have multiple Windows versions available like Windows 7, Windows 10, Windows 8.1 and Windows 8 and many more. So I am selecting the Windows 10 version here. Now click on apply and click on OK. Now the Vine will install some Geeko packages. So in order to install the Geeko packages Click on the install button. Alright, the Vine is configured successfully. 
Now let's talk about the wine control panel. Wine control panel is another useful utility that is included in wine. It allows you to configure game pads and tweak other useful options. You can run the wine control using the following command and the command is wine control hit enter. So this is the screen for the wine control panel and from here you can configure the game pads and tweak other useful options. Now let's talk about the wine tricks tool. Wine tricks is a handy tool that is shipped with wine. It allows you to install many third party libraries and apps from a GUI interface. To install the wine tricks in your Ubuntu 20.04 LTS, run the following command sudo apt install wine tricks. Hit enter. Enter your sudo password here. Press Y here to continue the installation process. Alright, the wine tricks is installed successfully. So now you can run the wine trick using the following command right here on the terminal wine tricks and hit enter. This is the dashboard screen of the wine tricks. From here you can view the help, you can install an application or you can install a benchmark. Moreover, you can install a game or you can select the default wine prefix, create a new wine prefix and enable silent install. Wine tricks also has a nice command line interface. You can know more about it by running the following command. Wine tricks double hyphen help. So this is the help that is available for the wine tricks and here you have multiple options that you can choose with the wine tricks and you can play with this tool. So that is how you can install and configure wine on your Ubuntu 20.04 LTS. So that's it for this video. I hope you found this video useful. Don't forget to subscribe our channel for more useful videos like this. Thank you.